Hi guys, I was in the middle of editing a video for you guys today, but I actually ran into something and I was super excited to try it out. So I want to um, create an impromptu video and have you guys experience it with me. So I ran into an article that talked about remote mouse and what this is is a mobile app that turns your mobile device or your iPad into a remote control so that you can control your laptop or your computer from wherever you are. Um, the reason why I thought this was really awesome is because I've been watching a ton of Netflix shows lately and I'm watching them in bed. So as lazy as it seems, I really don't want to get out of my warm bed just to click the mouse or click on my mouse pad. So I thought this would be a fun thing to try out. Once you download the app on the app store, you're going to have to also download the PC or Mac version going on their remotemouse.net website and downloading the server. So after you download the mobile app on your phone or your iPad, this is what it looks like. And it's this app right here. So what I'm going to do is just click on that. And it brings up this blank green screen and um, there's a bunch of functions. So I could get rid of the keypad, but what this does is basically your mouse trackpad that connects to your laptop. So before you want to do any of this though, you're going to want to connect your device to the same Wi-Fi connection as your computer or the laptop that you're using. I've already connected my device to my laptop, so they're both on the same Wi-Fi connection right now. Um, I just want to give this a spin and show you what it looks like. Okay, so after I connected both my device, mobile device to my laptop on the same Wi-Fi connection, it's going to let you um, use the mouse pad on your screen. Okay, so it looks like my connection just reset, so I'm going to have to start over again. So now I should be able to control my laptop from my own phone, which is pretty awesome. So right now, I'm looking at my Netflix account, and it's on House of Cards, um, which is the show I've been really into lately, and I can control it from wherever I am within range of the network connection, and I can press play, I could change the volume, I can also scroll using my two fingers, and that actually you can't do that right now because I'm not on the proper website to do that. But you can pause. Um, you could go to another tab. Keep scrolling. So it's a pretty neat div um, mobile app. And it's definitely something that I'm going to be using a ton now that I know about this. So it definitely is an app that I'm going to be using a lot from now on. Um, since I can control it using um, just my mobile device, I'm also going to install it on my iPad and I'm also going to tell my parents about this because they're going to love it. They would rather sit on the couch and control things from their laptop using just their mobile device, so I think it's pretty revolutionary. Um, why I've never heard about this until now, I, I do not know, but I definitely wanted to share it with you guys so that you guys are in the know also. Um, this is probably going to go into my February favorites video, but we'll see after I test it out for a couple more weeks. Um, so let me know if you decide to download this or if you've actually run into an app that's similar to this, but actually something that I would enjoy more. Just let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching and make sure to subscribe to Let's Tech About It on the upper right hand corner. Bye guys!